Hi, uh, everybody. It's Faith from Firesign Tarot. I hope everyone is well. We're going to knock out a couple more readings for... What are we doing here? February. Sorry. Get lost for a second. Just a couple more readings for February before I go to bed. Um, my son was off sick from school all week. Um, I don't know how many of you caught the last top and bottom of the deck reading, but you get a brief update on our little virus scare. And everybody's fine. We're all good. It's, it's just like this weird head cold, nasty virus thing. Everybody's fine. But yeah, so I have to knock out a couple readings and I have to go help him with his homework because it's Saturday night and he goes back to school Monday. So, and he has done absolutely zero of his homework because... He was literally sick in bed all week, so we have to get that knocked out. Anyway, enough about me. Who's getting red? Libra, it's your turn. This reading will be for Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus for February 2021. If it resonates with you, cool. It's your free will to whatever you choose to do with the message given by the cards. If you choose to do anything at all, it's your journey on my image reading cards. If it does not resonate with your sun sign, you can check your moon rising, your Venus sign readings if you think you might want something that may resonate a little bit better. Just keep in mind, time and energy are both fluid. All things can and maybe vice versa. It might be even play out from the perspective of, from the pers I have to slow down. From the perspective of a cross watcher and our dear friends, the cross watchers are always welcome here at the Fire Sign Tarot Table. Everyone's always welcome. I appreciate you guys stopping by. Thank you so much for popping in. Coffee. Excuse me. I still have a little tickle in my throat. Two things to keep in mind as well. Okay. One, never make any like major life choices based on a tarot reading, especially the life altering ones. And two, if it's definitely not your story and you probably shouldn't take anything out of it and it's just not vibing with you, just leave the cards on the table and walk away. Okay. Okay. All right. Why are you here? Five of Swords reversed, Libra. Some of you are just like, you know what? It, it's a poop storm. <laughs> I'm, I, I, I can't even deal with this. That's the vibe I'm getting off of that right now. Poop storm. Everybody walked off that battlefield and nobody won anything and there's just pieces scattered all over the place. Nothing's, nothing is even collectible. That's the vibe I'm getting off of that right now. How do you feel about the person you're dealing with? Ten of Wands reversed. Maybe they're having issues releasing a burden of some kind. Maybe there's something that they desperately want or need to get off their chest. Or maybe you have something you need to get off your chest in regards to them, maybe? Okay, what do you think of them? The lovers in the reverse. Oh, boy. Mm -hmm. Okay, well. The feeling wasn't mutual. Somebody had stronger feelings than the other person. Hmm. Okay. What do you want from them? The chariot in the reverse. That's a card of return, friends. Somebody wants to turn that chariot around and go back to where you were. Hmm. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Okay. How do they feel about you? Temperance. Card of Sagittarius. Might be a Sagittarius you're dealing with. It's Patience. Part of positive energy flow. I am hearing they had the patience of a saint. That's what I'm hearing right now. Not sure why, but I felt compelled to say that. What do they think of you? Judgment in the upright. Oh, 
Oh my. It's a card of resurrection. Hmm. I'll throw a clarifier on that. Wow, Libra. Okay. What do you want? What do they want from you, of you, or for you, or from you? Four of Pentacles reversed. They want you to let go. Something to be let go of. Released. Wow. Okay. Okay. What was the obstacle here? King of Wands. That's pretty open ended. The King of Wands. <laughs> I hate it when there's no way to dance around it, so I'm just not going to dance around it. I'm just going to be out with it. He's... He's good-looking. He's a beast. He's a beast. Let's just put it that way. He's passionate. He's sexy, always up for a good time. He's pretty much the more evolved, grown-up version of the Knight of Wands, and we all know that the Knight of Wands is the playboy of the tarot. I'm catching a vibe off of this. Somebody had a great deal of sexual energy going on. Not sure who. Wow. Okay. Not sure who this reading's for, but what's the possible resolution? The star. Okay. Apparently, there needs to be a healing here. We're going to sit on the outcome until the end and get some clarity. Universe, source, and spirit. Can I get some clarity in the cards on the table for my Libra friends, please? Lib Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. February 2021. What's left of February? I'm trying to get all these done by the 10th. Maybe the ninth. <coughs> For some odd reason, I always forget that February is the short month. And there's not 30 days. So, I like to try to get it, it all done and complete by the first third of the month. Just because I'm always so far behind. Because I'm just one of those people that life seems to happen to all the time. And I'm not sure why. One more good shuffle, I think we'll have it. Not trying to make excuses, I'm just stating facts. I wanted to have everything done by the first, and then, yeah. Life happened, and then I was going to sit and read cards on Tuesday, and then life definitely happened again, and it is what it is. We'll get there. It's just taken a little bit longer on the journey than it probably should have. All right. It's not when you get to the destination, it's the fun you had getting there. Who wants to talk? Knight of Swords. Oh boy. Everything kind of blew up because truths came out. That Knight of Swords. Hmm. It's not the Page of Swords in reverse, so that's um, hearing things that you didn't necessarily want to hear. So, definitely some truths came out, and that might be what blew everything apart, okay? Possibly things that happened behind closed doors as well. That is the alternate meeting for the Five of Swords in the reverse. Could be the vibe I'm catching from, yeah, that King of Wands, Five of Swords reverse. Not a sword. I'm not, I don't want to call somebody out as a cheater, but... I'm just catching a vibe, guys. I'm just catching a vibe. I don't know. It's not your story. Walk away from it. If it is your story, keep watching. Why is the Tide of Swords reversed here? Four of 
four of pentacles reversed. A burden that needs to be released. Something they need to get off their chest. Nine of swords in the reverse. Wow. Wow. It just kind of flew out in the reverse. So this can mean one of two things. It can mean not giving it a second thought or you've officially gone bat poop bonkers and you should probably be weaving baskets somewhere. Anyway, um, yeah, somebody's not sleeping well. This is, uh, someone is utterly consumed by this. I'm feeling guilt. Guilt. Somebody feels guilty about the situation. Why is the lovers reversed here? Okay. Knight of Pentacles reversed, Seven of Wands reversed. Stagnant energy, out of control. Not mutually felt, justice. Justice only pops up when an injustice has occurred. Oof. Oof. As Neon would say, oof. Stagnant energy, things not moving, communication not moving, offers being taken off the table. Things are out of control. Possibly the situation was out of control. Maybe you just weren't evenly matched. Possibly someone was as fair as they could be about the situation, considering circumstances. Why the justice? Why justice? Justice, why have you come to visit? Thank you. Flew out. Wow. Four of cups. Somebody felt ignored. Or someone thinks they were being ignored. Hmm. Okay. Why the chariot reversed? Okay, I dropped those. No way. Why the chariot reversed? The star. Wow. Okay. Well, it is the possible resolution. Someone wants to return to where they were. Somebody wants to close the gap. Somebody wants to heal. Somebody wants to improve the energy between you. Somebody's wishing upon a star, begging source for a second chance. Okay. Why is temperance here? Why temperance? Okay. You've decided to come out and play. Queen of Pentacles reversed. Why Queen of Pentacles reversed? of wands. Oh, wow. They had the patience of a saint. It's 
so many got away. Lever, you're the one that got away. Oh, wow. They feel like they didn't treat you well enough. Some of them maybe feel like let, they feel like they let you go too soon. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. You guys are mirroring each other a little bit here. Why is judgment here? Hi! King of Wands reversed. What do they think about the situation? Why the King of Wands reversed? Because the problem was the King of Wands. What was the problem? Be it male or female, it was the problem. Temperance. Someone may need to tone their charisma down a little bit. Improve the energy flow between you. Somebody wants to resurrect this. Somebody wants rainbows to shine again. Somebody wants y'all to get along better. Somebody wants their saint back. For real. Somebody wants to resurrect something with their saint. Somebody wants to resurrect something with one that got away. Why is four of pentacles here? Why is four of pentacles reversed here? Three of swords reversed. The tower. Why the tower? Seven of cups. One more. The High Priest. And the Nine of Wands reversed. Someone's very vulnerable. Someone's very humbled. Someone possibly knows that they may have taken a wrong path at some point and brought down a tower. Somebody wants to take that heartbreak away. Someone... Someone wants the ultimate connection. Somebody wants to fix this. They understand that the wrong path brought down the tower. And they're f feeling very humbled right now. Somebody made a very bad mistake. And I think someone came forward and was honest about that very bad mistake. And if they didn't come forward themselves, whoever the affected party was found out possibly may have found out via social media or saw something over the shoulder text message or a, a love note or a card that they weren't supposed to see. Someone saw something they weren't supposed to see. But the, that's the vibe I'm catching. <sighs> Oof. Wow. Okay. Okay. Long story short, someone... Somebody wants to fix this. Someone is very humbled by this situation. They want to fix it. They want to unbreak your heart. Oh my. Okay. Why is King of Wands here?
The Four of Swords and the Two of Cups. Oh my. Taking a break. Oh no. <sighs> you want my personal opinion? Which I probably shouldn't be giving in a tarot reading, but it's whatever at this point because I already, I already let the word slip out of my mouth. If y'all were in a committed relationship or a not so committed relationship, if you were in a relationship and had a break time, I think something may have happened on break time for swords to a cops. The four of swords talks about taking a break, taking a moment, take time out, time out. Oof, let me know if that resonated. Oof. Possible resolution. The stars. Why is the star here? Why the stars? Fool. Why the fool? The sun. The fool. Yes. Yes. It can indicate new paths. It is the start of the journey. It, it is the zero card. It is the fool that goes on the fool's journey through the tarot. It can indicate new adventures, new things, new places, new people. Yes. However, it can also indicate trust. It can. It takes a lot of trust. A lot of trust in source. For that dude to jump off that cliff. That takes a lot of trust. Because ultimately, you know, we all have free will. But I also firmly believe that we all have purpose. And you don't always fall flat on your face. Every once in a while, the universe kind of intervenes. It takes a lot of trust. And it takes a lot of trust between two people, especially when one of those people has been horribly hurt by the other. It takes trust to allow a healing process to begin. It takes trust to allow the other person to try to fix it. That is a card of trust, friends. One more. Oh, the sun. Sun. Trusting the connection. Again, it takes a lot of trust in that little boy that that horse isn't going to buck him off. They're a unit. They are. Horse and rider, they're a unit. They got to work together. They do. It's how I see it. Maybe I'm wrong, but it's how I'm interpreting it. A healing's got to take place here. Yeah, somebody screwed up. Somebody screwed up big time. I'm catching a vibe of somebody screwed up big time in this situation, but if it's fixable, it's fixable. It's not my journey. I'm just throwing down cards. Y'all want to fix it, fix it. What's the outcome? Oh, Knight of Cups reversed. Why the Knight of Cups reversed? Why is the Knight of Cups reversed here? Why is the Knight of Cups reversed here? Emperor. Why the Emperor? Six of Wands reversed. Oh, Libra. <clears throat> it's 
Sometimes you got to spill it to fill it. Sometimes you got to spill it to fill it. One more. The world. Okay. Old cycles ending, new cycles beginning. Sometimes you got to spill the cup to fill the cup. Sometimes you got to let somebody know who's in charge. And sometimes you got to let somebody know what is and is not going to fly in your connection. You, you just got to be straight with them. You do. You do. Sometimes you got to knock the wind out of somebody's sails or knock them off their soapbox a little bit. Especially when they get rowdy. <laughs> Somebody getting rowdy. Oh no, it ain't going to be like that. No, 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 friend. Let's get some advice for my Libra friends. You got to have trust. And sometimes the advice has absolutely nothing to do with the reading. Ten of Pentacles upright. High... Uh, Hierophant. It's the Hierophant. This is it says Hierophant reversed. You need to concentrate on stabilizing this. You do. Because the Ten of Pentacles is a goal. The Ten of Pentacles is the happy family in the big brick house with a white picket fence and the 2.5 kids and the dog and the pool out back and and the nice fancy car in the driveway and sunset sipping lemonade, watching the grandkids run around the backyard, catch fireflies. It's it's the life dream. It's the goal. It's where everybody wants to get. You you need to concentrate on building the stable foundation for that and not jump into going to the next level of the blessed union. You know what I'm saying? You need to ask yourself, is this the person I want to be sitting on a porch with in X amount of years, sipping lemonade, watching the sunset while our grandkids play in the black, in the backyard and catch fireflies. Is this the person it's going to be? You need to ask yourself that. Okay. I mean, whatevs. Sometimes Sometimes the cards give good advice. Five of Wands reversed and the Page of Pentacles. You got to stop squabbling long enough to hear what the other person has to say. Sometimes you just got to sit down and let the other person talk and put your offers on the table. So... Stop fighting and sit down and talk calmly and slowly and rationally and listen to what the other person has to say. Not that you're not doing that already. You're a Libra. My mother was a Libra. God rest her soul. I miss her. I miss her dearly. I think about her every time I do a Libra reading. Ace of Swords reversed, Queen of Swords. If you're going to open your mouth, truth better come out. If you're going to speak, speak truth or speak nothing at all. Now is time for honest conversations. Karma and the High Priestess reversed. You ain't going to resurrect nothing if egos get in the way. So check your ego at the door before you go sit down and throw offers on the table. Okay, I'm going to check out, read my next set of cards, and then I got to go help the kid with some homework. So be blessed. Know that you're loved. And I will catch you guys on Tuesday for the work week top and bottom of the deck, unless I can get it done before that. And hopefully um, I'll be able to do two February readings this month. I don't know. We're going to see how things go because, you know, my voice and life and all that jazz. But if anything, I will catch you guys for your March read. Be blessed. Talk soon.